Hey, Miss Cohen here with the Cohen Review, and I want to go over the new 2023 COPD Gold Guidelines. So, new material for your nurse practitioner board. So, let's review. Under COPD classification, you'll see that we have stage one through stage four, stage four being the most severe. And on the right side, under definitions, we have your spirometry results because spirometry is what we use to diagnose COPD. Now, the new piece of information, it's the groups. We used to have groups A, B, C, D. Now we only have A, B, and E. E is grouped C and D. Now, A is for your mild, B is for your more, more symptoms than your A, and then stages three and four are your groups E. And that means that the particular individual has had at least two flare-ups in the last year or at least one hospitalization because of the COPD. Now remember, there are two pieces of data to decide on COPD treatment groups. The first is your CAT score or CAT score, which is an A item questionnaire that assesses the health status in patients with COPD. The second piece of information is how many recurrent hospitalizations they have had. Now, another thing to remember is that in COPD, we do not use the step-up approach treatment like we use in asthma. Now, if you remember these things about COPD, you will do just fine on the exams. But to find out more information about COPD and everything you need to know about for the nurse practitioner boards, don't forget to check out the COVID review. Find the link in the bio.